can't rely on that. He should have known better. I used to say that myself. Himself. He should have known better. That's no secret. You don't have to tell me that. What do you want from me? Can you help me improve my abilities? I could show you how to use your strength better in close combat. A lot of fighters are very weak because they don't have the technique to use their strength properly. The same is true for dexterity and ranged weapons. I want to improve my abilities. What are the rules for a duel? Quite simple. Both opponents have to have the opportunity to draw their weapons before the first blow. You can't just go and belt one of the men without warning. There has to be some sort of spoken challenge, an insult, or another reason to fight. None of the other men will interfere in a fight like that, unless one of the two gets killed in the duel. I want to join the mercenaries. Oh, and why do you think I should be in favor of you being accepted here? Put me to the test. Did Lee send you to me? No. Then what are you blathering at me for? How's it going? The militia has bullied us long enough. Now that the mercenaries are on our side, they won't dare to just show up here anymore. The king may think he can get away with anything, but we're not going to take it anymore. In town, they're talking about a peasant's revolt. Nonsense. We aren't doing anything except defending what we've worked hard for. It's certainly true that the war is being fought on the backs of the peasants. But Onar is no longer prepared to just stand by and watch while the king bleeds us dry. There's nothing you can do about it. Can I rest somewhere around here? If you're looking for a place to sleep, go to the barn. But don't lie down in a mercenary's bed by mistake. Onar makes sure that they leave us farmers alone. But with strangers who don't belong on the farm, the mercenaries can do whatever they like. Cypher told me somebody stole a package of swamp weed from him. And? He thinks you're the one who took it. Oh, that's why the guy is always gopping at me so stupidly. I've been extra friendly to him lately because he seems to have hit a rough spot. But there was nothing I could do. I'd look at him friendly-like and he'd stare at me like he wanted to kill me. What's up? Damn it. What's up? Damn it. Hello. I'm What's new up? here. Don't Damn take it. this the wrong way, what but I'm not want? really in the mood for conversation. I'm totally wrecked. You're awfully busy, huh? You can say that again. Bennett makes so many weapons that I can hardly keep up with the polishing. What can you tell me about the farm? This is Onar's farm. That big building is his house. He vacated a wing for the mercenaries. We farmers have had to bunk in the barn ever since. But it's all right with me. It's good that we have people who guard the farm. The kitchen is in the building with the smithy in front. Maybe you'll be lucky and Thecla will have something for you to eat. Can I buy weapons from you? I don't have much. We take almost all the swords and axes into Onar's house.
What about the mercenaries? Onar hired them to keep the city militia off our backs. But they also guard the farm, the sheep, and us farmers. So don't even think about stealing anything or rummaging around in somebody's chest. They're just waiting for a chance to knock you down. You don't have to talk as much. Don't Nobody will learn anything, anything from me. I will never Man, cheat. My belly arm That's all just was gossip. After him. Do you really believe That's that? all just gossip. That's no really secret. didn't deserve that. that. All along. Do you really believe change. that? That was quite that obvious. Change. That was really true. Really deserve that. That's Tell me the that first I've heard really of it. Not my problem. Is it really that true? I agree long. with you completely. Same old thing all listen. over again. I'm not telling you anything you need to believe these days. You just have to listen to change. Know better. Wait a minute. That was really obvious. I agree with you that. completely. I'm not going to you leave here. I guess we're gonna have to discuss this again. I agree with you completely. Ah, not my problem. Show him! Don't say you didn't know that. Go ahead, get back! No idea. That's Ow! Gossip. That hit the spot. <laughs> not bad. You showed him who's boss. I'm more, myself. Believe me. Not even any gold. <laughs> You just have to listen. I think I'll take That's your been weapon. A long time. That's been known a long time. I that guess was quite it. obvious. Of course, really we got it in the end. And that's the truth. I'd have gone about it differently. He never would have thought of that himself. You, you don't believe, believe everything you hear. The things I could get so worked up. I couldn't care. You already know who to believe these days. Nobody will learn anything from me. That was quite obvious. That's no secret. Touching that. That's all just gossip. I'm yeah. not telling you anything. He really said that. Tell me that isn't true. Well, I've heard a thing or two. You. Nothing Same amazes old me thing anymore. All over again. You listen you to the wrong people. people. Believe these days. So sure. Believe me. That's that the first change. I've heard of it. I'm not telling you anything new. What is it really true? Change? I never really thought as much. He thinks he might easy. get so worked up. I never knew really that. Know you better. That's all just gossip. Don't say you didn't know that. Hey, you! The two of us should have a chat. I wouldn't know about what! How's it going? Have I given you permission to address me? Thecla has a problem with you. So? What is the dear lady's problem? And why doesn't she come herself? You know that damn well. Why don't you go discuss that with my friend Bulko for a while? Silvio doesn't like being talked to. You might have gathered as much by now. Cut out this magic crap. Smart kid.
Not even any gold. <laughs> no problem solved, Miss Dahl. I think I'll take your weapon. She thinks it's as easy as that. That was obvious all along. I don't want to hear that. As if I didn't have enough problems. There's more, believe me. Nobody will learn anything from me. That's exactly what I said. I used to say that myself. Nobody will learn anything from me. You already know what I think. No one really wants to hear that. That was obvious. Name for father. Some problems solve themselves. No you idea. Can be tell me. I'm not telling you. It's hardly know what's going on. What do you think of Lee? Oh, he's a good fighter. I wouldn't ever want to pick a fight with him. Unless, of course, it couldn't be avoided. Hey, asshole! You don't actually think I'd get involved in a duel with you. Go crawl back under your rock. A lot of people talk about you. A lot of people talk too much. The two of us should have a chat. I wouldn't know about what. How's it going? Have I given you permission to address me? Don't say you didn't hear that. Have I given you didn't get that from any gun about it differently? Put away that weapon! See? That wasn't so hard. Oh my god. There's smack! Not bad. Let that be a lesson to dare him. attack me again. That was quite obvious. I think I'll take the poison pill. Not even any gold. That only cause more trouble. I think I'll take your weapon. Well, it never just have to listen. That's all enough, kinds you know? of rumors. My God! Finish Show him. him! Don't Finish stop him. now! Filthy thief! Just you wait! I keep now your I paws keep off my stuff from now on. Got it? Hmm, that doesn't surprise me. Thanks for the gold, you hero. The Don't people. you try that again. Wait a minute. The two of us should have a chat. Listen, you won. Now leave me alone. Me anymore. Nobody will learn anything from me. It was his decision, wasn't it? Had to happen He really said that. Is it really true? been there. Well, it never changed. You should really have known better. It was his decision, wasn't it? Yeah, he really said that. I never knew that. Just listen to him talk. You have to step in and sort things out. No idea. You tell me. Don't tell me you didn't know that himself. Hey. A cursed thief? I really had it with you now! Lee won't let you get away with it! All that matters is much. So don't tell me that. I used to say that like that. That's all just.
just gossip. Never knew that. And that's the truth. That's been known a so long sure. time. Tell that isn't true. It can't go on changed. like this forever. It's a bad business. <laughs> that's not what I heard. That's from my opinion. And that's the truth. You don't have to tell me that. All that matters is strength. Don't tell me you didn't know that. Is it really true? And there's more, believe hey, me. Hey, where do you think you're going? To the house, of course. Onar pays us not to let guys like you in here. I want to talk to Lee. <laughs> what do you want from him? That's really not my problem. He and I go way back. You're a pal of Lee's? I don't believe a word. But go on in. He doesn't recognize you. <laughs> You'll know it. Lee's in the right wing. Don't even think about wandering around anywhere else. <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. All that matters is strength. Doesn't see that. That was nobody there. It can't go on like this. I'm in enough trouble as it is. Who the devil let you in here? You are the new fellow who has been causing trouble? I have heard from Gorn that you were still alive, but that you would come here anyway. It's a good thing you've come. I have heard that you stole something here. You just can't pull that kind of thing around here. In such cases, owner insists that I bring the culprit to account. That means you pay and he pockets the cash. But then at least the matter is forgotten. How much? 300 gold pieces. That's all just gossip. I want to pay the penalty. Good. I'll see to it that Onar gets the money. You can consider the matter forgotten. Gorn told you about me? What happened to him? You remember him, don't you? Sure. He got caught by the paladins and was sent back to the Valley of Mines with a penal convoy. If the road to the Valley of Mines wasn't plastered with paladins and orcs, I'd have sent a couple of the boys already to free him. But the way things are, there's no point. Poor devil. What exactly are you doing here? Quite simple. I'm gonna see to it that we all get off this island. Onar hired us to defend his farm, and that's exactly what we're gonna do. But our reward is more than just our pay. By helping the farmers, we cut the city off from its provisions. And the less the paladins have to eat, the sooner they'll listen when I finally make them an offer of peace. What is your offer going to look like? Essentially, it will be about our pardons and free passage to the mainland. You'll learn more when the time comes. I absolutely must talk to the paladins in town. Can you help me get to them? What's your business with the paladins? That's a long story. I've got time. <sighs> Zardos sent me on a mission. He wants me to obtain a powerful amulet, the Eye of Inos. So you're still allied to that necromancer? I see. And the paladins have this amulet? As far as I know, yes. I can help you get to the paladins, but first you need to become one of us. How can you help me get to the paladins? Trust me, I've got a plan. I think you're the right man for it. I'll take you to the paladins, and you'll do me a favor. But first, join us. I want to join you. I'd hope you say that. I can use every able man here. The last mercenaries I accepted have done nothing but stir up trouble. In principle, you can start right away. Well, first there's one or two things we need to get straight, but it's no big deal. What do I have to get straight before I can join you? Onar, the landowner, is the one who employs us. You can only stay on the farm with his approval. And then there's the boys. I can only accept you if a majority of the mercenaries agree that you join us. But don't go to Onar before everything is straightened out. He's a very impatient fellow. How can I convince the mercenaries to vote me in? By doing what is expected of you as a mercenary, I should say. Talk to Torloff. He's usually outside in front of the house. He'll put you to the test. If you can pass that, you should have earned a large part of the necessary respect. He'll tell you everything else you need to know. What do you know about the Ring of Water? <laughs> I might have known. You just have to mingle in everything, don't you? Come on, tell me. I'm only marginally involved in this. 
I know that this secret guild exists here and that the water mages are behind it. Since the fall of the barrier, I am no longer bound to the agreement I came to with the water mages back then. Of course I still help when I can, but most of the time, I have my own problems and barely any time for other things. If you want to know more about it, you should probably talk to Cord. He's one of them, as far as I know. I'm ready to join you. Not before you've passed Tarloff's test. Everything fine with you? So, you want to join us then, hmm? Do you even have a decent weapon? How did you end up with the mercenaries? I came with Silvio from the south. We belong to an army of mercenaries which fought against the orcs. What's your opinion of Silvio? He's a dangerous fella, and many of the mercenaries who came with him this far listen to what he says. Better not pick a fight with him. What's your opinion of Lee? I think that the only thing Lee is really interested in is getting away from this island. He wants to go to the mainland. Seems to have a bone to pick with someone there. At any rate, he does a far better job than Silvio ever could. Moreover, he's a good leader. Most of the time, we can do whatever we want here. Would you mind if I joined you? Once you have passed the test, I shall vote for you. What weapons do you have to offer? Only the best. Just take a look at them. to step in and sort things out. Do you really believe that? I'm no better off myself. Don't even think about touching anything here. Otherwise, you'll get a couple upside the head, got it? What's your job? Onar wants me to spend all day keeping an eye on his stuff. He's worried that something will go missing, and I would too in his place. Most of the mercenaries he's hired are former convicts from the penal colony. They'll walk off with everything that isn't nailed down if no one watches out. There's a whole bunch of junk here. That's right. And most of it is extremely valuable. Onar collects valuable objects. A simple man like me can hardly afford such luxury. I stick to other things. And that would be? I collect old coins. Has anyone tried to steal anything yet? A few, and I caught them all. Who let you in here? What are you doing here on my farm? You're revolting against the city, or so I've heard. Now listen up. I inherited this farm and this land from my father. And he inherited it from his father. I'm not going to allow that greedy imbecile of a king to make off with all that just in order to feed his useless armies. The war with the orcs has been going on forever. And where do we stand? On the edge of defeat. No, I prefer to defend my farm myself. The money that I save this way can pay for my own army. Everything all right here on the farm? I don't see how that's any of your business. You don't belong on the farm. I want to work for you. I don't need a farmhand right now. My people see to everything else. You have no business here in the house, so get out. I want to buy a sheep. What are you doing here, then? See a sheep anywhere? I... If you want to buy a sheep... Go out to the pasture. It's to the right of my house. Have Pepe sell you one.
Who are you? I am Onar's wife, Maria. What do you want here? I just wanted to have a look around here. With all these men on the farm now, there's no peace to be had inside the house. They just keep barging in here. Do the mercenaries bother you? Oh, well, at least the farm has been a lot safer since the mercenaries came. Back when we were still on our own, the militia came from town all the time to plunder our provisions. They dragged off the better part of the harvest, and they took some sheep, too. They did nothing for us in return. A few of those scoundrels even stole from us. So what did they steal from you? Mostly gold and silver. They even took my wedding present, a golden plate. I bet it's now gathering dust in the chest of some filthy city guard. Tell me about Onar. He's a good man, a little grumpy and very impatient, but we've all got our faults. I told my husband, why do you let the soldiers from the city treat you like that? Do something, I said. So he hired the mercenaries. Now I feel like I'm in the middle of a war. But then, we are at war, aren't we? Has anything exciting happened here lately? The paladins passed by here. At first we thought they were going to attack the farm, but they were headed for the Valley of Mines. I have a golden plate here. Would this be yours? Yes, that is it. Thanks a million. That's not what I heard. So, what about my reward? Do you want to hire on as a mercenary here on the farm? You never would have thought of that no, not really. Then take this gold as a reward. You've earned it. Myself. Already thought that much. I never I don't believe that. this is going to change. All that matters is strength. So and that's the truth. Hey, that. you! You said he never would have thought of that himself. Put me to the test. Did Lee send you to me? And there's he said you would help me. Made. Fine. So here we go. There are two things you have to do I before you can join us. First, you have to prove no that you're really capable of mastering that. the tasks that you will have to much. fulfill as a mercenary. Don't tell me you didn't I'll know put that. you to the test. And second, you have to so earn the respect of the other mercenaries. Well, how can I earn the respect of the other mercenaries? For most of them, it'll be enough if you fulfill your task and pass my test. But you'll have to find some other way of convincing some of them. Some will try and exploit your situation, and others that. may not like your mug. That's not what I you should try to get along with as many of the boys myself. as possible. But if nothing else helps, then you can always what take part in a sure. duel. If you win, no, you'll earn the respect of most of them. But watch me. out that you Tell don't kill that. one of them by accident, but because then you'll have a big problem. Will it ever change? Nobody will learn anything from me. No, no what are my duties as a mercenary? Onar hired us for two reasons. He wants us to keep the militia off his back, and he wants us to keep things in order on his farms. That includes collecting the rent when the small farmers won't pay. So, what'll it be? really not my problem. Been there, done that. I'll deal with the militia, don't worry. The farmer Bengar has complained that lately the militia from the city has been getting on his nerves. They're pressuring the farmer, probably trying to make him break with Onar. I want you to go to his farm and make it clear to the militia that they have no business there. Questions? How can I find Bengar's farm? In the southwest of the valley is a big stairway that leads to a high plain. That's where Bengar's farm is. If you get lost, ask the farmers in the fields how to find your way around the area. That's the first I've heard of it. That's all just gossip. That's been known a long time. That will never change. Nobody ever asks for my opinion. Nothing amazes me anymore. You hardly know who to believe these days. days. That's no secret. I don't know if thought as much. I couldn't get away with that. That's all just gossip. That was I'm not telling you anything I new. I couldn't care. Let's wait and see what happens. And nobody just ever asked for my opinion. opinion. That's really not my problem. There you are again. How many of Silvio's men are still on my list? I've bested Bulko. I heard. Not bad. Rod looks a little worse for the wear. 
Fester tried to take me for a ride. That was his mistake. That's enough. That's enough. I'm impressed. If Lee asks me, I can vote for you without hesitation. You really let Bulko have it, honey. Must have been an exhausting job to thrash that fat swine. Here, have a bite to eat so you'll gain back your strength. Can I have some more of your stew? I haven't got any now. Not even a tiny bowl? No. Can I lick the pot then? Will you cut it out? If you're so keen on my stew, you'll have to do something to get it. What? Go see Sagita, the healer who lives behind Sekob's farm, and bring me a package of her herbs. If you bring me the herbs, I'll make you some stew. Wait a minute. The two of us should have a chat. Listen, you won now. Leave me alone. I don't believe this is trouble as it is. Do you really believe that? You didn't get that from me. Hey! What do you want this time? Sooner or later. Methinks I'm gonna punch you in the face. What? That's exactly what you need right now. I've been too nice to you so far, haven't I? I couldn't tell that. And now, for the fun part. Defend yourself! Watch out! Defend yourself! Go Watch ahead, out. hit back! That's the first I've heard of it. Go ahead, hit back! Ah! It's been a long time. Defend yourself! Ah! Go out. ahead, hit back! Parry Defend then. yourself! Nothing in yeah! Let ah. him have it! Ever asked for Go ahead, hit back! I'm no better off myself. You don't have Watch out! <laughs> Perry then! <Not> bad <laughs> you showed him who's boss. Of course we got him in the end. Gold. Okay, that's mine for starters. I never knew you had. I think I'll take your weapon for safekeeping. He never would have thought of that, that himself. I couldn't care you know, less. I get so worked up. Tell that That's isn't true. really not my problem. Nothing was quite obvious. You just have to listen to the wrong people. No one really knows I've got no to tell you anything. Like hey, you! Do I have to show you again who's boss? <laughs> Things I can tell you. Methinks I'm gonna punch you in the face. What? That's exactly what you need right now. I've been too nice to you so far, haven't I? That's been that isn't You're sm My God! A fight! Ah! I've gone about it differently. Not bad at all. <laughs> you showed him who was boss. I'm no better off myself. The bastard doesn't even have any gold on him. I think I'll take your weapon for safekeeping. I'm never I'm staying out of it. Don't no say you didn't know that. Do you I'm not telling you anything, do you? No idea, you tell me. Same old thing you all you over again. You got my own opinion about that. You just have to listen. You don't you have to tell me that. Oh. that Nothing in me is hiding in tell you. You got my own opinion about that. Hey, you! Do I have to show you again? I've got no time for things like that. What? That's ex- I- Oh my god! Ah! Yeah. Slug him! Listen to him. That's the first I've heard of it. The bastard doesn't even have any gold on him. 
That was obvious all along. I think I'll take your weapon for safekeeping. I've got no time for things like that. It's a bad business. That's really not my problem. Of course we got him in the end. I'm staying out of there too. Don't tell me you didn't know that. Do you really believe that? No Do I have to show you again? What? That's exact. I that was no big deal. You hardly know who to believe these days. You, mustn't believe you have don't to step have to in and that. sort things out. He I've got even no know time to hold a sword. That, that will never so change. Sure. We'll see about that. You have to tell me that. All right, all right, you win. What do you want? It had to happen sooner or later. That's exactly what I said. I'd like to become a mercenary here. Do you mind? Ah, uh, do whatever you want. Can't rely on this. Let's wait and see what happens. He doesn't even know how to hold a sword.